us the cattle master here. Yes, I know. That's what everyone says. Oh, my cattle master. <laughs> That's a strange name, but I adore it. Anyway, welcome to the hospital of cattles. Yes, you heard right. The hospital of cattles. Here, in this hospital, we keep your cattles 24 out of 7. Yes? Uh, yes, mm, the hospital of cattles was made about... Mm, three years back it was made to help lonely people feel accepted and safe. That's right. This place is the only facility for now, but I'm sure it will grow. There are many things to do here, but of course... You must do them while cuddling. You can watch TV, play video games, watch movies, or just sit in silence and cuddle. You can even just sleep and cuddle while you do. It's history. Mm, this place was made by my mother. She took a look at the world and suddenly she said, You know, everyone in this world would be calmer if we just cuddled with someone. And then she started this place. Now you should know you must choose your cuddler. And this is an all day thing, so I hope you have nothing left to do. Good. Now, here is a list. Choose who you want to cuddle with. Oh, you choose me? An excellent choice. Now come, come with me. So, we have many facilities here. What would you like to do first? Watch a movie? Alright. Then, what movie? We have many types to choose from. Action, comedy, romance. <laughs> ah, romance, is it? Well then, let's watch... Let me just change... The cuddle must always change for the occasion. All right, here we are, all comfy. Now sit down, and I can do with you. There we go. And the movie is starting. Hmm, you're so warm. <laughs> you're choosing that movie? You, sir, have excellent taste. So tell me, why you chose to come to the hospital of cuddles? Oh, hmm, a bad breakup. I am sorry, sweetie. Yes, here we talk to you as if we are your lover. It's to help ease the pain of whatever you have come to get away from. I will not judge you. I will not hate you. Here at the Hospital of Cattles, we will always greet you with acceptance. It's wonderful, don't worry. I know you're going through a bad breakup, but sometimes it helps to be treated tenderly. So, don't worry. I'll do 
treat you so tenderly, you will be held by the time you leave, my wonderful patience. I shall give you the warmest touch, the gentlest acceptance, and the most tender cuddles that will make your heart sing with joy once again, as you deserve. Do you want to talk about what happened? Ah. Mm. Yes. Mm. I see. What? Oh, that horrible person. Oh, you're such a sweet person. You really did that for them and they still betrayed you I hope they get hit by a car what? they <laughs> they did get hit after they betrayed you? well that's why you don't build up that bad karma so what makes you love this movie hmm. it's the movie that made your parents fall in love with each other oh that's so romantic hmm. 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 what a wonderful movie so what do you want to do next? Uh, you want to watch some TV? Ooh, a cop show! <laughs> I love mysteries! <laughs> of course! It's always fun to watch mysteries! I've been into them since I was a child! It's always so thrilling to find out what happened and why! Mm, no, I am not good at solving mysteries. So, what do you do for a living? <laughs> You're a detective. No wonder you love mysteries. You know what I've noticed? Everyone bashes cops, but not detectives. And not that I want them to, but it's just weird to me. But now I see why you needed cutouts. You poor dear. Don't worry, I'll take special care of you. What? Me? Well, to be honest, I... I always wanted to be a doctor. Yeah, I tried to go to school for it. My grandmother was a doctor and she tried to help me by teaching me what she knew. But it was all so confusing to me. To remember such typical names was breaking me. So instead, I wanted to be a matchmaker. I was always so good helping people with romance. I actually did that for a time, but then the company went bully up after it was found the whole thing was a scam. I was getting people together, but the head honchos were doing really stupid things like embezzling money and making fake profiles and keeping people on the side with hopes of getting that fake person. I didn't even know about it, and thankfully, I wasn't put in jail for it. Hmm? <laughs> it was you that stopped them? 
Well, well then, thank you. Yeah, it's true. I lost my job and a bunch of other people did too, but many of those people work here now, so it worked out. Besides, mm, I don't blame you. You were just stopping some idiots. And you're here because you need some cuddles. Like so. Mm. Mm. So, it might be a touchy subject, but what's the full story about the betrayal? Hmm, I see. So, they were part of a crime family, and they were meant to make you fall in love with them. I am so sorry about that. You even got married to them and then they tried to kill you. Oh, that's unforgivable. You need extra special cuddles. Like this big hug. <laughs> See, you're smiling. That means your heart is in a state as you say. You know, you're pretty young for a detective. <laughs> a genius, are you? Well, then I shall be calling you Sherlock Holmes. <laughs> no, sorry. It's just I've never been out so tightly before. I. I think I really like it. Mm, so warm. That person is an idiot for leaving you. You deserve so much better. So, so very much better. Mm. Uh, yes, we did sort of get off your question, didn't I? Well, when I started working here, it was perfect. It combined the healing of a doctor with the romance that I like. I am a cattle doctor, and we are the best doctors, at least in the romance department. And that's not nice. <laughs> you wouldn't trust me with your life. <laughs> I think I'd do very well in healing you. Just... Mm, not with needles or medicine. Me? <laughs> no. I am not married. To work here, you can't be married. Well, no, that's not completely accurate. You can be married, you just can't be a cattle doctor. You can answer the phones or become a manager or a janitor or something else. You just can't be a cattle doctor. <laughs> That policy came into effect when one of the girls here got married and one day her jealous husband came in and caused such a commotion and it became chaos. Hmm? You're laughing again. How are you feeling? Better? Good. Good. But you can't leave just yet. Remember, this is an all-day experience. You are not allowed to leave in the middle of the session. Penalties? 
Well, you have to pay a $400 living charge. I know, I know. The entrance fee is much, much less than that. But this is how it works. I make $17 an hour just cuddling someone all day. But if you leave, my pay stops going. We only get paid when someone comes in and we cuddle with them. So say you cuddle with me for one hour, I only got paid 17 bucks that day if I don't have anyone else choose me. Oh, yes, this place makes a lot of money. We are referred by a lot of people. People who need Cuddles like you. <laughs> now let us continue cuddling. I may get paid for it, but honestly, I am actually very lonely, so cuddling heals me too. And you are so, so very warm. So Please, don't leave. And please, always come back for me.